Hello and welcome back to some more Stellaris. It has been a while since I've had the time to sit down and do a session of this game, so let's get to it. I, uh, I totally forgot where we were in, uh, in the Interstellar Owl Sovereignty. Um, but I can see here that we have two planets and uh, I think this means we have 15 fleet uh, limit. Maybe that's not right. Um, but I see that uh, I, I saved it as Iron Man. So uh, if I if I screw up, we uh, we can't um, we we can't re redo it. So um, it will be interesting. In interesting. What the fuck? Interesting to. Um, to see if we can, uh, how far we can we can get with this. Uh, let's see what we have. What is the situation here? This is us. We um, we have this, and we have a colony up here. The colony is almost uh, complete, which would make in uh, which would make it. Uh, a fully uh, fully fledged uh, planet thingy instead of uh, instead of a colony, and we have some quest things here. Let's see the situation log. Um, bum bum. Is that the supply probes thingy? I think that's it. We are still missing uh, four probes. We have three here we also have to investigate some things there so let's get started we have last time I think we uh, we were fighting the aliens and uh, took some damage so let's send the ship back to base to get repaired we have the rest of our fleet there the newly made fleet and are we making anything here? I don't think we are. Are we saving up for a colony? Maybe. So far we have explored these systems here. We can build in this system. It has 14 spots. So um, that is a possibility to uh, to plant a colony here but uh, the question is if we should wait for that because as we as we get more colonies it will cost more to research and such so that would make us fall behind we would get stronger but we would uh, we would fall behind overall we have a capacity of 13 so I don't know what the what the 15 thing then but uh, Let's start and move up to fast. Colony established. No, come to think of it, I think we should just uh, stay on normal. We have this one done. And let's uh, do a hydroponic farm there. That's a nice food place. We have an okay income of minerals. And. Should we go out and fight? I don't remember how uh, strong the aliens around this area is. So we should um, maybe just just wait for the fighting till we um, till we get some stronger ships. For example, we are researching uh, shields up here. This is the first uh, the first shield research deflectors. I actually play, played a game where I didn't uh, get get shields at all, where I just had to rely on armor. That was uh, an interesting experience to um, to not uh, to not have that um, have that as an as an opportunity. It's weird how the borders are so are so jacked. I think they used to be more round. 
Or is it just me? Hmm. Weird. So we have the science ship going. We have a build ship here. Guess we have researched this whole system. Yeah, we must have the. There's just not any uh, any uh, resources there. So at this point, we don't really need to um, need to make any more science ships because our science ship can only go to these systems. And Debris we analyzed. would need resources to make another gate and we would need resources to make another science ship. So first I think we should just make another gate and then think about the science ship. And we have uh, researched some, some debris Research complete. in Hoyam system after the last battle and we are, we are researching some more debris. So where's that going? 21% and our fleet is complete. I think we should uh, join these together. We lost the Admiral in the battle. So we should maybe uh, get a new one. Merge these guys. And we got a new physics research. So let's just get this. Uh, it's very nice to get it this early, the research speed. I think um, in the long run we will uh, we will get a, l a lot of use out of this, so that's pretty cool. So Admiral, let's check. What can we do? He have evasion, very good evasion. Lead a lifespan, that's also very nice, but these guys are pretty old. Fire rate, it is 44. I think he is uh, he's the better choice here. I'm not sure how uh, how fire rate translates, but uh, but to me it sounds like 10% more fire rate means he fire 10% more shots, meaning uh, he fire one uh, he fire a tenth um, more weapons in a battle something like that we are done building our design queue in uh, in react let's check saurus saurus check the surface here we can upgrade this what is the yeah. price for this can we see the price we have an upgrade here. Uh, okay, we can see the price here. 90. Sure. Let's do that. And we are... No, actually let's wait for that. And looks like we are getting a guy here on an area with nothing. So uh, I suggest we move this guy. And then we make a power plant over here. And we should also get um should also get a farm here and maybe a power plant here and uh get the last slots opened. Would be nice to get some more science going, but it's not uh it's not the first priority. Start the timer again. Not a lot is going on at this point. We are pretty much just waiting for resources. What could we do on this rock? We have some uh, some opportunities for um, for mines. One there, one very good one here. But then we need to uh, Debris get analyzed. The, to get the uh, tech to get that removed. See what we got. We got some engineering and some physics. Mm -hmm. Pretty cool. The longer we get into the game, the more interesting stuff we will get from researching the space debris. So uh, that will be nice to 
get that. I think we did not research this system fully. Oh, okay. Interesting. This is uh, this is from the from the probe mission. Looks like uh, one of our probes has become sentient. Okay, so uh, no matter what we say, they will uh, they will uh, become hostile. Situation log updated. Science ship under attack. Let's, Evading uh, hostile fleet. Okay, that ship is going back already. And let's uh, see how strong it is. 62, that's pretty strong for, uh, for probe. Come on, get away! Wow. Our science ship took a, took a beating there. Go home and repair. Upgrade to the latest design, for sure. Hostile fleet engaged. Ships upgraded. Construction we have complete. engaged the enemy. Pew pew pew! Not laser guns, but missiles. Fire the missiles! While it is uh, bombarding us with lasers. Complete. So the probe is destroyed. Little remains of the strange alien modifications that our missing subland probe had been subjected to, but we did manage to collect some valuable engineering data from the wreckage. Its memory bank was also salvaged, and from it we have extracted survey data from the entire uh, Romanox system. Excellent. Situation log updated. So, science ship, go back, research. Research project in the system, yeah, yeah. That's what we uh, sent you to do. And. Should we just. Should we just do another science ship? Maybe that's, uh, that's the play right now. Science ship? Sure. So, when can we get a spaceport here? That's pretty expensive, so uh, we may have to wait on that. But we should uh, should check these down here to uh, finish the probe mission. I think we get something good Construction out of it. Construction complete. We have finished construction on Sabak. Oops, surface. That's what I meant to click. So, what should we do? Debris analyzed. We need some. What do we need? We need some power, really. <coughs> Could have no, could not have up upgraded this for power. We analyzed the debris, and we got nothing. Wow. Okay. There was a little save there. This is a new science ship. Let's just wait a little. And all our scientists are busy. Okay. So. None of the scientists uh, available right now are very good at uh, at exploring and stuff. So um, I think we'll just go with the youngest guy here. So let's recruit this guy. Let's check if we got another uh, a better. Yeah, let's let let's do this guy instead. It may be a bit of a waste of influence, but. Uh, but I think it was uh, it was worth it. This guy is younger, which means we will uh, we will get um, we will get more out of him. He will uh, he will very likely be uh, be a higher level, and we are gonna need uh, gonna need him to be uh, level four and five for some of the 
anomalies. So uh, I think that was the right play. Let's um, send him down. Can't we? Uh, I guess we will just send him down and then see what goes on. Send the other one here, and we should maybe keep the fleet ready. The fleet is 100% uh, here, so let's just uh, send the fleet just preemptively. Research and complete. Our resources. We have done a research. So we can now do the Corvette assembly yard. We are not really uh, going to be doing that because we are not uh, going to focus on, on Corvettes. I don't think that's uh, that's the right play. Oh, and we already had, a, had an industrial guy. So now we should either get uh, iron frosters and get uh, faster ships, get um, better missiles on the ships, or get defensive platforms. I uh, I never really used the uh, used the planetary uh, defense platform thingy. Um, deep space platforms, half the gravity wells of a planetary body. I never really uh, used these, but um, but it's um, it's nice. I heard because a thing you can do is uh, if we go into this system, we can see where I, where they will they will come in from the other systems. So if we if we put uh, put defense around these, then uh, then we will be pretty safe from people coming from these areas. I think that's how it works. I'm not uh, not 100% sure on that, but uh, that is uh, my uh, assumption. So we have uh, discovered another sublight probe. On domesticated plumage has detected one of our missing sublight probes in the Beta Cali system. We should begin recovery efforts as soon as possible. Situation log updated. Okay, so let's see here. Let's have him research the project. It may um, go smoother than uh, than expected, but. Um, I am expecting some weird stuff to happen. That that's normally what happens. And what can we build here? There's an Arctic world. Would be very nice to get um, to get Arctic colonization. We did um, we did build our people around being uh, being supremists. So I don't think they will uh, will get along with other species. So we will. Maybe have to uh, have to engineer our people a little bit to um, to make them more capable of surviving in other uh, in other areas. We will see when we get to that. Let's see another sublight probe discovered. Defiant Blumitz has discovered one of our missing sublight probes in the. The Citra system. We should begin recovery if it's a situation possible. log updated. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. And while we wait for that, let's check our resources. We are still not um, very far. In that would be very nice to um, to research the areas up here. I think we have sent. Uh, yeah, we uh, we have already sent our, uh, our fleet up complete. here to uh, to make the to make the first um, research of the systems. So that is. Did we lose a ship? I think it was ninety nine. Oh well. Maybe we should spend our um, spend our 
our minerals on uh, on doing more ships. We are done building on the surface of Saurus. Oh, Sabak in Saurus. And we can spend 90 on upgrading this. But we will also need to um, take care of this guy. How much food do we have? We don't really have a big food surplus. So it would make sense to do a hydro farm here. Yeah. And start the timer again. Still lacking minerals. And we are busy recovering the probes. Let's check the election thingy here. So, we are, as a democratic nation, we get elections now and then. We can spend... I think we can, yeah, we can... Uh, we can spend influence to get, uh, to get another guy elected. So far this guy has the most... Um, the most uh, the most support and he is also higher level and uh, we gain extra influence if we complete their uh, if we complete their uh, political goals this guy wants to make at least four new orbital research stations that is um, not very likely. This guy wants to legalize slavery. This guy wants to make a lot of ships. And this guy wants to make at least four new orbital mining stations. That is very likely if we to a station down here. It will cost. Uh, it will cost influence, but it will be very good because there's a lot of uh, minerals down there. But I don't think we should support anyone because this guy will will get voted in no matter what we do at this point. So let's uh, let's save the influence and uh, and just have them vote him in. It's uh, I think it's yeah it's it's this guy the guy we are already uh, already having lead our our country. He is uh, he is resilient. That's pretty good. He will probably get a lot of level before before dying. And uh, frontier outposts will uh, is. Uh, it's a lot cheaper. That's not really a, a good uh, policy thing because we are we don't really have any frontier outposts. If he made wormholes or mines or something like that cheaper, then then it would be more interesting. And we can't click this away. Oh well. And. How much did it cost for us to... Situation log updated. Okay, he was elected. Very good. And... How much did it cost for us to do another colony? 360. That is expensive. This guy is almost done. Is this... Special project complete. Let's see what it says. Oops, let's see what it says. We have recovered the sublight probe in the Beta Kali system. The sensor's telemetry, uh, it collect what? The sensor telemetry it has collected over the years has provided us with a complete survey of all planetary bodies within the system. It's not like we already had discovered that. Um, but I was more curious if this system was within our, was within uh, 
neutral space or within this guy's space. Construction complete. I forgot uh, what kind of uh, people they are. All oh, right, they are also Eva. So we could very likely be uh, be, be friends with these guys. But um, yeah, I don't know how. Um, how friendly we're gonna be. I just got the uh, non-aggression pack to um, to make sure they didn't um, just come at us at an unexpected time. They can still do that, but they will have to uh, break the pact first, and Special they, will, project uh, complete. they will likely give us some time. Okay, uh, the other one was not very interesting, like the last one. So the situation look, we still need to find the last probe, but we can't see it for some reason. Maybe it's up here. Maybe it's not. Criminally insane pirate station, pirate fleet. Wow. Lies within the covenant space. Wait, wait. Let's survey this. Let's let's. What should we do? Should we do more ships? Upgrades of the latest uh, latest designs, at least, and we will see if they uh, get something interesting. We decided not to do the uh, missiles at this point. We went with defensive platforms. So um, we will see how that works out. And, Ships uh, upgraded. None Construction of our complete. Are within the respective areas our scientists are good at, so it's going slow. Let's see if we can uh, get some some better scientists. These guys are pretty nice. These guys would be good at um, good at flying around and do the anomaly stuff. We have too many leaders. All oh, right, we have to uh, have to fire you. Yes, goodbye. He is uh, our president is from the loyalist faction, and uh, he have one hundred percent support. So uh, that's why he got uh, re-elected so easily. Just uh, survey this place. Looks like uh, nothing bad will happen there. And we just finished uh, construction in, in the Cirrus system. And we just finished upgrading here. They got a little stronger. Let's see what they actually got. They got small nuclear missiles. That's the standard missiles we have. And they got uh, small deflectors. So they will have some shielding before taking uh, taking actual hull damage in a battle. So that will be useful. Alien menace. Are they really dangerous, or uh, do we just see them as a menace because we are supremacist assholes? I think we just see them as a menace. They look neutral. Anomaly found. And we found an anomaly. Okay, so this guy will actually be uh, be the best guy for the job, so let's have him do it. And in the next check we have enough resources for a new colony, so maybe we should just go ahead and settle this. I think that's what we're going to do.